welcome back to my channel. I'm Jen. Thank you so much for joining me. Today we're going to unbox this Be Happy box from the Happy Planner and Disney, The Little Mermaid. I'm really excited to see some of this stuff in person. It's really pretty. Um, I don't believe I'm going to keep everything in this box. I think I'm going to de-stash some of it, but there's some stuff I really love in here, especially this like designed stuff, this beachy tropical ocean theme. I love these colors. So let's look at it and see what we think about the value. This is a $54.99 box. Um, there was free shipping when it came out. Let's go beyond the surface. If it doesn't sell out, it will likely be discounted later on. It does take a while for that to happen, and they do sell out sometimes. So um, if you're interested, the best thing to do with these boxes is just go ahead and get it. Um, you cannot use points on it, but use, you know, if it's, use it to your advantage if you're shopping a uh, release, you can use this towards um, free shipping. If you're, um, yeah, if there's a free shipping promo like they had with this, which is a good deal because these usually don't have free shipping. Um, so we got Wonders and Curiosities. The sticker's really cute. Oh, and it's peeling off. That's unusual. Oh, it's ripping. Say hey, it's unusual that the sticker, it's not. Okay. Peels off. I'm almost, oh, oh, stern it. Okay. And I love the green tissue paper. It looks kind of blue, teal blue, but it's actually more of a green with a seafoam color shell. Okay, and this is ready to be heard. And then this is our little, like, guide to our box find your voice take your adventures under the sea this be happy box features tropical prints rainbow foils and your favorite underwater friends so we have a sticky notepad quickly write reminders or rearrange your schedule at any time with these seashell sticky notes um i think this is kind of big for rearranging a schedule in my planner <laughs> however i guess it could cover some stuff up i actually really like this um, it's not super thick. Like that one we got in the squad box was fat. It's so thick. This is a good size because if I have more than this, it's too much. Um, the colors are really weird because of this paper, I think. Let me, that's a little better. So yeah, this is pretty, it's like a, it's like a lavender. It almost looks pink to me in my camera, but I'm going to try and lighten it up a little, my camera a little bit. Um, let me do it. Okay. And then this is one of my favorite things. This pouch, it's kind of got rounded corners. It's like a canvas with the stuff printed on. Okay. And there's a nice navy blue. So this can go around your planner and hold all your pens and things. Uh, let's see what it says. Canvas pouch. Collect dingle hoppers and thingamabobs in this branded, banded canvas pouch. Sorry, guys. So, yeah, I love these banded items. Um, I think they're great. I love that they fit on my planner. I love that they can hold a lot of small things that I can take in the other room with me or if I'm traveling. That is definitely another item that I'm real excited about. So, our is this is this one yeah one bookmark save your place in your notebook with this convenient snap in bookmark so i think that kind of there's a notebook um oh it's clear i love this okay and then if you're new to happy planner if you get something like this most of them have like a clear film over it this is um one it kind of keeps it from getting scratched up and it's just part it's just like leftover from production they've told us in the past so you just peel it off and it makes it look much more vibrant and glossy and then yeah there is your bookmark beautiful I love this and I love that it's cut out at the top so there will be a top tab and it's kind of fits in with the the design that's great okay we got some envelopes store all your what's it's and who's it's and these are vibrant snap-in envelopes Okay, so we got Treasure the Moment with Ariel. And this is the live action movie, obviously, if you <laughs> didn't know. Um, I love these colors. I have a million of these, so I don't know if I'm going to keep all these. I don't love the new um, Critters, her sidekicks designs. Although these aren't quite as bad as some of the, like, like the designs from the movie. This is Beach Buddies. And then Sea Witch with Ursula. That is a really fun little expression she has on her face. That's so cute. 
This is cute. I love this. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep all three of these because I really don't need them. I haven't been using them very much. But um, I might destash them. So that's a maybe. Okay, and then we have some, ooh, a folder and filler. <laughs> I grabbed two things. So I love this folder. I'm 100% keeping this. Magic Beneath the Seas. It's got that gorgeous design on it. Um, I am going to put this in my planner in July. Perfect for summer. Okay, and then let's see, what does it say? Carry all your mermaid essentials in this pocket folder that snaps directly into your notebook. This is classic fill paper. Make to-do lists and plans with this classic fill paper and always be ready for your next adventure. So it says daily tasks. There's like a green shaded dot grid. There's flounder at the bottom and Sebastian at the top. Uh, again, they're not my favorite. I love the band of this paper though. And then there's scuttle on the back with a grid. Uh, yes, this is my favorite filler paper from the Happy Planners, this design. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm probably going to keep this. I don't love those. Like I said, I don't love the characters, the way they look. I know they're supposed to look realistic. I just don't like the, the ones they picked, I guess. I guess Sebastian has to look like a crab, but I don't love, he, he's okay in these designs and I don't, they changed the bird. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of the, the sidekicks. Um, this paper is absolutely gorgeous though, and you can always cover some of that stuff up. Um, so I will probably keep that. Uh, there is a sticker book. Did I read about the paper? Yeah. Decorate your notebook with these large stickers featuring holographic rainbow foil. So let's just look at it. Okay. So this is exclusive. To, all of this is exclusive to the box. Um, I have seen sneaks of some, a regular size sticker book and maybe a planner or a plans and notes or something. I think it's going to be on Amazon. If this is like the stitch box last year, it will come out in July or so, and um, it will be only on Amazon. So let's take a look at this stuff. Find Your Voice is the name of this book. Ooh, pretty. That hollow is gorgeous. Some people don't like the hollow. I love it. It is not easy to photograph, though, so I can understand that. There's this gorgeous big sticker of Ariel and Flounder. Then more of those creepy looking <laughs> fish. Uh, sidekicks, I mean. Um, my voice is a treasure. Always be kind. Ocean feels. I like the way the letters have the, the color design. Purple foil and paper. Stay kind. My turn in the sun. Stay true and embrace your journey. Adventure comes in waves. Ariel. The sidekicks. And then some designs. Vibe with the tide. Take a risk. Here's some quotes. Family is a treasure. Explore land and sea. Go beyond the surface. Dream with all your heart. Ready to be heard. Human stuff, explore up above wonders and curiosities. These are all clear again. Um, find your voice. My true voice lives within. Explore everything. Make ready to make a splash. These are some like super thick washi strips. I love those. There's an Ursula sticker, nice big with the purple foil. Fate can be cruel. Oh, and there are her eels. I thought they weren't in the movie. They must be. Sea Witch, Rule the Waves, The Ocean Will Be Mine. Nice. Um, I think these would match with some of the villain stickers all right, too. Then we got some just, like, different, you know, shells and, and um, seaweed and thing, the motif that's on the box. Two different pages of those. Ooh, yes, and those letters. I really love the way these look. Two pages of those. And that is everything. So um, I'm glad they're going to have potentially more stickers coming out because... Um, I definitely could use more, and this color palette is gorgeous. So there's that. I'm yeah, I'm gonna keep the stickers. And then, ooh, okay. I thought I might not keep this notebook, but I'm not sure now. Okay, well I thought there was more stuff I didn't want to keep from this box. Like I'll probably destash some of that paper. I'll probably destash those envelopes. I might destash those sh that shell thing. I don't know. I mean, they're nice and big, but they're not very practical. Okay, I'm keeping these discs. They're purple marble. Gorgeous. I don't know. There we go. They're plastic, and they're mini, but, um, yeah, I really like them. They don't have mini purple marble anywhere, and this says my voice is a treasure, and it's got, it's really pretty. That hollow is really pretty. Oh, I love the inside cover. Gorgeous. Okay, obviously, I love this design. That's... That was the, okay, what is going on here? Is it supposed to be like that? I don't think so. 
Like, it almost looks dirty. This always happens to me. I don't know what's going on there. Is that part of the design? Because it doesn't look like that anywhere else. I don't think so. Yeah, I think something's stuck. Because it's on this side, too. I bet when it was printing. That's lame. Yeah. Okay, anyway. <laughs> this says Take a Risk with Ariel on a purple divider. And then the back has her creepy little guys. Don't love that divider. This one side's okay. I don't love that side. I love this paper with the little seashells and flowers. Oh, I love this. So I'll use this for like one-off pages in my planner or just notes, like whatever. Um, part of your world with that pretty design. Explore it, land, and see. I love these purple discs. Ooh, I like that one better than the other one. Okay, I don't love that first divider, mainly because the creepy, the creepy. I just don't like these guys. I don't like the way they look. I know they're supposed to be, uh, oh, made of salt water. That's cute, though. I know they're supposed to look realistic. I get it. I just, I will say the images in this box are better than the movie Im images I've seen, but I don't love it. I don't love them. I'm also really partial to the original movie. If you saw my unboxing, my haul, I mean, of the summer refresh, you heard me go on about it. This is pretty, I don't know. I'm kind of bummed about that. Like, that makes me mad. Um, it's just like something that happened when they were making, when it was being made. It's not, whatever. Uh, this says, write your wishes and dreams in this classic notebook to take with you on all your adventures. That is everything. I love this little card, except it's got the creeper, the creepy characters on it. But I like this, um, ready to be heard with the leaves. Yeah, I love, I love the colors and things in this. I just wish that some of the stuff wasn't as creepy looking. Like the sea creatures weren't quite as creepy looking. Otherwise, you know, I'd be... I'm going to put this in here for now so it doesn't get bent up. Anytime I open filler and don't put it in something, it gets bent up. Okay, that way I got everything together. I'm probably going to de-stash some of the paper and prob probably some of this paper because I don't need 60 pages. Um, I might de-stash this cover. I don't know. Not because of this, just because I do like that one, though. I don't know if I'm going to use it. I'm going to keep this. I'm definitely, almost sure, certainly, probably not going to keep these. I just don't need them. Um, I love this bookmark. That's one of the things I loved. I love this pouch. I'm on the fence about this notebook. Um, love my stickers. So yeah, I'll probably de stash some of these smaller accessories and some paper. Uh, but otherwise, a pretty good book. Okay, and it said it was $55. So here's the thing. The Disney stuff is always more because it's licensed. So this is a $26 book right here. I would not pay $26 for this book. There's not enough stickers in here. Um, and this is probably $20 normally for Disney. So that would be $46 or yeah, $46 right there. This is going to be, I'd say, oh gosh, I'd say 12, but it's Disney. So, well, maybe 12 is right. So what I say? 46. So these three things are the, the cost of the box. Plus we have filler paper, the folder, the envelope, the bookmark, and the notepad. So it's definitely got the value. Um, the only thing is I would not normally pay that much for any of this stuff. I'd get it on sale. So um, is it worth the VAT, like the value of it? Yes. Like it's worth what it's worth more than the cost of the box. So if you're concerned about that, it's a good value as far as that is goes. Um, but only if you want all the items in your box or you know somebody that you can share them with. Otherwise, um, like I said, I've seen sneaks of more Little Mermaid stuff. So if you're not like super attached to anything like me, then <laughs> go ahead and wait for that release. I hope you guys are having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.